Hello and welcome back to Fury, where I finally got her in the final phase. Where she's just angry. Maybe I'll finally beat her. Did I do it? I did it. That phase was irritating as hell to get her through. That's what she gets for being an irritating bitch that kept shooting me every time I tried to help her. Well done. You put her out of her misery. The hell? Thought we were gonna set her free to have her help. Pretty sure it wasn't death. She was so wild, so they put her in a cage. Then you came along and they did even worse. Way worse. It all went so wrong. Apparently. But we are going to make things right again. I don't know about that. I feel like we're gonna fuck things up even worse. It's a very interesting game. And the title of it works very well. Fury, because it induces rage when you start failing. Why does that rock look like it's staring at me? That rock is rude. Very pretty scenery, though. I enjoy the way this game looks. Now I just wonder how rage-inducing the next boss is going to be. Especially given that that was only the second one. It's like a dream. The breeze, the peace. It feels like we could take off and leave this place behind us. Are we gonna? Because that'd be a lot simpler. Nothing is what it seems. We're stuck here. The real world is somewhere else. Down there. And you're a weird, bunny-headed man that hasn't been very helpful and hasn't really told me shit. And I'm walking on the side of a thing, apparently, because this just looks crooked. Now it's almost upside down. I wish I could walk faster. Although, I guess walking slow works if you can walk on the side of something. I mean, that would come in handy at some points. Is he not even going to give us any more story info right now? Did the bunny man just abandon us already? There he is. There's more to him than meets the eye. A master of time, so they say. But if he's such a master, if he saw it all coming, why didn't he do something about it? Why didn't he stop it from happening? Stop what from happening? But look where we ended up. I feel like I'm being manipulated by the bunny man. How far away is this guy? Very calming music in between fights, though. It's just relaxing. Easy for him. He chose to be here. But we are definitely not cool with this. We are getting out of here. He keeps saying we, but the character I'm using hasn't spoke once. Are we sure he even wants to leave? Maybe he was comfortable being tortured. Maybe he's a masochist. Time to move on. Go 
cross his path, my friend. The jailer is the key. How's the jailer the key? We already killed him. Or do I have to like literally use the jailer's head as a key or something? A lot of this game really reminds me of Afro Samurai. That's weird. So he's just gonna keep putting me in the same place again? And repeating it? That just sounds like a paradox. Well, I can't shoot at it apparently. Because all it does is like, keep like, repeating. Wait, can I not get them to, like, break inside and then continuously shoot in there? Wait for that to go past. Slowly making progress on this, it seems. This guy just seems like he's going to be kind of slow.
Ah, shit. Nope, I cannot see that I'm fighting with myself, because I'm trying to kill you. I got him. This is a weird fight. Ah, damn it. Holy shit. Damn it, I was way too fucking close. Damn, this guy is confusing to fight. Ah, damn it, I didn't think that shot went through and hit him. Starting to get the hang of this. I don't think I can make every second count. God damn, these guys are confusing as hell. I 
I gotta remember not to be close to it when I do that. I think I've gotten the hang of this part of it. Starting to figure him out. Oh wait, shit, I can't shoot those. Finally learning his patterns. God damn it. I'm not learning his patterns well, though. Well, on that note, I'm going to end this episode here for now, and we'll fight him again next time. Thank you for watching, and have a wonderful day.